Welcome to your daily inspiration messages. We have the ego and this represents Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael is coming in to free you from whatever has been restricting you. The illusion of being trapped, accept responsibility for your situation and then make choices that support your path to happiness. And it could also represent addictions or unhealthy habits. So it's important to take a look at this. And if we have been practicing unhealthy habits, we can free ourselves from this. Okay, and let's see what we have from the Energy Oracle cards. Rest and rejuvenation is needed right now. If you like numerology, that's 19. That breaks down to 10, which tells me this is the end of a cycle where maybe you've been feeling trapped or stuck and you find a way to free yourself by forming healthier habits or um, uh, healthier uh, daily habits, I should say. So something that you implement um, to each day of your life. Let's get another one from here. Oh, blossoming abundance and number three. Very nice. This is going to open up your world to more beautiful things, happier things, more satisfying things. Okay. You're making some big changes here. All right. So let's go further here with the everyday witch. What else do we have? If you hear snoring, that's my beautiful baby boy, Bo. Well, he's a cat, he's not a human baby. <laughs> but he's behind me here snoozing really hard. Okay, rest and rejuvenation. Oh, there we go, this is going to bring you strength. Very nice. You could be dealing with a Leo too, but not necessarily. Your world may have been feeling very stormy as we see with the tornado here. Some rest and rejuvenation is going to help you to see that things really aren't as bad as they seem. Okay, the ego um, or the devil energy in the traditional tarot is being clarified by the ace of wands. Okay, so when you free yourself, all these beautiful creative ideas are going to come your way. Life is gonna look a lot more fun and be a lot more fun. Choosing healthier things, um, it's just gonna really open up your mind, your world, your heart to healthier things that are more satisfying. Um, music, I see the music notes popping out on this card. So I feel like um, music is going to help you a lot um be careful of the vibe of the music okay none of this angry stuff okay no angry music okay blossoming abundance is being clarified by the moon yeah there's a lot of hidden surprises here for you things that are going to make you really happy so it's important to not hide yourself away from the world because you know you may be trying to protect yourself but it's kind of like taking an antibiotic. It takes away the good bacteria and the bad bacteria, right? So, um, you know, you typically, you know, what's recommended nowadays is to replace that with probiotics, right? So I don't know why I'm going into like, you know, antibiotics and medication um, metaphors here. But what I'm trying to say is if you're trying to protect yourself, and hiding inside you're protecting yourself from the bad and the good okay so it's time to start trusting yourself better trust yourself to make better decisions um, in the company you keep the jobs you accept things like that trust yourself because there's beautiful things manifesting for you that you don't want to miss out on because you're hiding away let's get another row of clarifiers here could be dealing with the Pisces or you could be a Pisces. Okay, so we have the death card. So yeah, so this is a huge transformation because we have two major arcana here with strength and death. And this is below rest and rejuvenation. Like I think many of you are not realizing just how much you need to take a break um, and get true sleep and also take a break from a certain relationship or situation. And when you do this, you're going to see more clearly, you're gonna close a door to the past and go through the door to the future where there's abundance, opportunity, healthier connections. Okay. And ego and ace of wands is being clarified, but another ace here. So if you had a particular question, the answer is yes. Um, there might be a new job opportunity for you that's much more prosperous. And um, the sun shining in the background is making me feel like you're going to not really feel like you're working. You may be very, very busy. Um, and productive, but it doesn't feel like work because you're productive and you're being paid well. So this is something that you might want to look for and get out of the mindset of being in a job that you hate, but it's a paycheck. It might not be enough, but it's still money, right? Don't leave that job until you have a new job, but it's time to like free yourself from that mindset because there's something where you can really do what you love 
and make better money and not feel stressed. You might be very busy, like I said, but <clears throat> it doesn't come with the same kind of stress. It's more like that, the healthy, like productive, um, you know, satisfying. I don't want to call it stress. I'm trying to avoid that word. Um, you might be very tired at the end of the day, but it's the healthy tired. Okay, and then what's this? Um, the blossoming abundance and moon. So that's strong manifestation energy here. It's being clarified by the nine of wands. So you've been working really, really hard, wondering if you're getting anywhere, but keep going because your abundance is coming your way. Your break is coming your way and it's not, um, it's not undeserved, okay? You've worked really hard for this and something's going to open up for you an opportunity. Thank you so much for being here. Please like, share, and subscribe and I'll see you again soon.